In this quick tip video, we will be showing you how to complete a non-modal restart. Before we get started, let's define a non-modal restart. Non-modal restart is generally used when restarting a program from a tool change or a tool call within a program. This type of restart will not activate any modal codes that come before the search line that will be run. We do have the option of using a modal restart that will research and activate any modal codes that come before the search line in the program. A separate video will define the modal restart function and its use. The purpose of doing a non-modal restart is using the program search button in a program which utilizes line numbers and block numbers to find a location inside the program. A line number is designated by an N, followed by a number, such as N2, shown here in the example. A good practice would be to designate a tool change line with a line number. In this example, we have the line number matching our tool number, 2. Thus, we have an N2 preceding the T2. Now, when we go to do our restart, we can search for line number 2 so that we can reach the proper tool number and process. To start the restart process, press the search menu key. Now, we can type in the search command two ways. The first way is to type in the program number. Then a slash. Then the number line. In this example, we will type in 1234 slash 2. In order to start the search process, we will press input. You will see the program stop at the line you requested. You can now press cycle start to engage the program. The second way is just to type in the line number. Type a slash in first to allow it to go to the default program, which is located here. Then the line number. In this example, we will type in slash 2. In order to start the search process, we will press input. You will see the program stop at the line you requested. You can now press cycle start to execute the program. The second option of doing a non-modal restart is using the Edit Menu key button. In this example, we have a line number matching our tool number, 2, thus we have the N2 preceding the T2 in the program. Now, when we go to do a restart, we can search for line number 2 or the tool number 2 also. First, we press the Edit Menu key and monitor. Next we move the cursor down to the line we want to start at. In this case, we need to start at a tool change. So we move to that line two ways. First, we could just use the page down keys or the cursor keys to get to that line. To execute the restart search, we press input. Search completed appears at the bottom of the screen. Press close to remove the edit screen. We can also use the string search to quickly find the tool change line also. First, we press the string search menu key in the edit mode and monitor. Then, we type in the tool we want to start at. In this case, we type in T2. To execute the tool search, we press input. Once we are at the T2, press string search menu key again to exit the string search mode. To execute the restart search, press Input. Search completed appears at the bottom of the screen. Press Close to remove the edit screen. Either way, we are now at the line we wish to start from. You should see it here in the program window. From here, you just press Cycle Start to execute the program from the start point you needed. Some parameters may need to be adjusted for your restarts to complete as needed. Those are listed here in this final page.